want to do a quick video. It's been a while since I've done one. Um, we keep getting new stuff in, and I have a hard time stopping and actually taking a video. So I'm going to video these few things that I got added to the website, and then I'll try to do more shorter videos in the future. That way we can get them popped on quicker for you. Um, so let's show. Okay, an adhesive. This is a double sided, easy to tear adhesive tape. It's that nice quarter inch or six millimeter size. This makes really, if you're wanting some really strong tape, it helps to hold down if you're doing interactive cards or anything like that where you need a really strong adhesive. These are great to have on hand. Then I started carrying these. There is the gorgeous doll line. These are the paper elements. So they're kind of like die cuts. They're so pretty. There's 140 pieces in here. Look at all this. They're so pretty. So if you scrapbook anything, little girl, or make cards, or use your journals or anything, these little accent pieces are so pretty, so easy to use. And I have some more here in this pile, so keep watching. Um, this one here. It is art by, by Marlene. It's more paper accents. These are punch outs. You get 20 sheets. And this is an eight by eight size. See if it does, see the back there. Look at all this. So many images. Cutesy, you got, I mean, look at those. There's cows, there's birds. Girls, mermaids, dogs, more animals, chickens, ocean animals. Amazing. And Marlene is an amazing artist. And look at all this. Beautiful. Easy to punch out. You don't have to fussy cut these. I believe these are punch outs. Yeah, these are punch outs. Even though it shows scissors on. Oh, it says no, no cut. These are punch outs. Super easy. And speaking of punch outs, this is from Chow Bello, the Midnight Spell Cinderella. You get 24 sheets, six by six. I think these say, these say fussy cut on them. Sheets of these beautiful Cinderella images. Six by six size, made in Italy. We will be adding more from this line. People have been asking, and we've listened. Here's more punch outs. Arctic winter. These beautiful winter animals. And not just animals, images. Here's some florals and an animal. More florals. I'm kind of sideways here. Here we go. Beautiful florals. I think there's eight different image pages, and you get three sheets of each. Pretty those are. Arctic winter, 250. These are punch outs. Now here is a six by six paper pad. Very hug. It's got tape on it, so it's gonna be hard to I'm just gonna kind of flip here. These are six by six. I love kind of the ombre brush stroke texture kind of these have on them. Very pretty. 24 sheets. 12 designs. So you get two sheets of every design. They're called Winklebush from Fairy Hugs. Really like these also. Okay. This is a large. This is a 6x6 six six pad. Craft Consortium. Let Spring Begin. Look at those two elves. Beautiful, double-sided, awesome for card making, scrapbooking, do mini books, or use them to make your accents, do you know, quarter, quarter page, you can even use the cover, cut those pieces out, embellishments, make photo mats out of these, these 
pieces, six by six pad, 40 sheets. 40 sheets. And these are really nice, heavy weighted papers. And here, same company, 40 sheets again. Fairy Wishes. Similar to the other one, you've got really pretty fairies. Mushroom images. They just have those really pretty bold patterns. Love, love, love them. Fairy wishes. Here is an embossing folder. Primrose. See the good price points. Why I added these in. Easy to use. Make a gorgeous impression on front of a card. One of my favorite adhesives. Um, I've had these before. These are like the sticky specs. Let's see. So here it shows. This sheet is full of dotted ad adhesive dots, I guess you'd say. So you just rub, put your die cut, so you run some through a Cricut or, or your Sizzix machine or something, and it's really intricate, detailed. You can just lay your die cut on top of these sheets and then Peel it off and it's ready to stick. You don't have to use uh, messy uh, liquid glue or glue sticks or anything like this. You get let's put eight sheets in here. These are five by seven by 8.3 sheets. And I believe I have another size also. I haven't got those inventory yet, so they'll be added a little bit later. Have some of these on, on hand. Try them out. You will always have these on hand. Amazing, amazing. Okay, Studio Light. They have this wonderful sticker book. Let's show you. Look, all of the phrases. You will find a phrase to add to a card or to your journal or any. I mean, there's so many. And there's alphabets. They kept, the colors are this black, matte black, a craft, and there's kind of a brick red type color. So nice, neutral tones. A huge sticker book. 21 sheets. 21 sheets in this book. Here, there's a good. French is about showing all the. So you get one sheet of each color in each sticker. Love to have. All right. So here's these gorgeous dolls. These are stamps. So. I brought two of them in to try. This one here is called Be Kind to the Ocean. She's got a cute little jellyfish there. This one here is Kind to Our Planet. They're really pretty little dolls. She's got some little like leaves or greenery that she's holding. These, you can just use your markers and color these little pretty dolls. Add them to the front of a card. Let your, your kids even. These would be adorable little paper dolls. Stamp them out. They can stamp them and then color them in however they want. Cut them out and they've got their own dolls. I love these. We'll be adding more. Um, here is Woodware's Tiny Gingerbread. We had the other gingerbread stamp and was really popular. So we added these little tiny ones in. I like how this one's got the brownie face. You got happy faces, sad faces, a little girl with her bows. Got some little words. Adorable. Always need gingerbread. Here's a really pretty journaling type of art, artsy grunge stamp. I think it's a songbird from Marianne. Got the music note pattern behind it there. Make really pretty images. Last but not least here is, let's see what's it called. Don't tell me. A really pretty frame die from Marianne. Actually, you can see here you, you can use the outer layer, you can use the inner layer, you've got some inside pieces to decorate. I like how they come apart, you don't have to use it as a one piece can. You, want, you can make layers really pretty there. So, this whole stock of stuff added to the site. Uh, we've got so many more things. Always check it out countrycroppers.com. You can Click on the categories link at the very top right. Look at all the different subcategories that we have there for you. There is one that's new products that shows you everything that's added. 
even if it's older, whenever it's added to the site, it's there in chronological order. Maybe a new thing, it may be an older thing we found and we got it added in there. Uh, there's many, many categories. You'll find so many fun things on there. Um, countrycroppers.com. And I'll get back with you with another video soon. Thank you.